On this day in 1945, FAO's constitution was signed in Quebec. During its first years, FAO was hosted in Washington, D.C., before it transferred to Rome in 1951. The dream is that every man, woman, and child in the world should have the food he needs to be really healthy. It is the beginning of a great world plan which will put common sense into the affairs of men. A plan which will put politics and economics on the road to world prosperity and world peace. When FAO was founded, the world had just come out of World War II, with large parts of the world facing hunger and deprivation. FAO's founders believed agriculture to be the cornerstone of human development. And in the past 75 years, the world has made great progress in the fight against poverty, hunger, and malnutrition. However, challenges still exist. Today, there are too many people who do not eat three healthy meals a day. Even before COVID-19 struck, more than two billion people did not have regular access to enough safe, nutritious food. Nearly 700 million people were going to bed hungry. The economic disruption caused by the coronavirus pandemic threatens to push another 130 million people into hunger by the end of the year. FAO's mission and its mandate are as relevant as ever. Over these 75 years, FAO and its partners have worked hand in hand with communities where food security has been threatened by conflict, economic shocks, environmental disasters, and pests. To address these challenges, we will have to effectively harness the data, technology, and innovations needed. And we will continue to work together with existing and new partners.